Look what we did here. We moved the, the board. <laughs> so we can eat three. Okay, <laughs> we'll chat with Kevin and Chris here in a second. And I'm just, just going to eat and let them talk. Lee, how about that? That's right. Is I that think okay? that sounds perfect. Yep. By the way, I want to point out, uh, Lee is so creative because on this board, she also put these little, are these hexagon, octagons? I can't um, even tell. Hexagons. Yeah. Um, for depth, and she put little beads down the middle. It's all about creating levels and heights and textures. And it's really about how the presentation, be creative with it. Because if you got this giant one, you could also put a tiny security board on top of that as well. Right. And yep. do different layers. Yes. I love the creativity of it all. Me too. It's so good. Okay, I think we got him now. Uh, it's time to check in with Kevin and Chris from 98.7, The Dove. Good morning, guys. Wait, I can't hear you. Wait, I can't hear them. Is that a joke? Are they playing a joke on us? Look, I'll read your lips. Ask to unmute. Are you there? How about that? There yeah, we are. There we are. There hey. we are. They were Listen, teasing. Listen, we are, uh, you know, technology-wise, maybe a little behind the eight ball. That's all right. <laughs> Third ball. How you guys doing? We're doing good. How's it going over there? Yes. Yeah. It's the weekend's here, man. We're pumped. So, uh, Kevin, you know, I slipped over there to do my uh, movie break with them yeah. about an hour ago. And because uh, we're talking about game, uh, the big game on uh, Sunday. More specifically, what do you eat? Food. What do you like but to eat? There was a tray there. Can you uh, tell us a little bit about that? Because I didn't get to partake. Yeah, Lee Porter, my beautiful guest co-host today, made a cream cheese board full of cream cheese dips with crackers and veggies. It is. Ooh. It is right up your alley, Chris Luzader. Yes, wow. I saw it sitting there. I almost took it, brought it here, but I didn't think that'd be very nice. She know, even, uh, by the way, she even flew in fresh uh, crab dip from Alaska. Not even kidding. Wow, wow, that now that's a little fancier than my spread. I, I what I, I mean, I do love some, but I got like easy cheese, you know, out of the can. <laughs> um, <laughs> You know, I mean, and some chicken on, and a biscuit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> little Tabasco. I like a good port wine cheese ball myself, you know. So what are you having on Sunday? Well, we're having wings, pizza, and then we like to make these jalapeno poppers wrapped in bacon. If they're mm -hmm. easy and delicious. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, we are having uh, an appetizer pizza. A pizza <laughs> and a dessert pizza. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing you like pizza. <laughs> it sounds it's like. my favorite. No, we're probably just going to have a couple pizzas. Yeah. Nice. Lee, what about you? A couple. Couple pizzas. We're gonna do little smokies wrapped in bacon with brown sugar on them and baked, mm. caramelized. Mm. And then probably some wings yeah. and some I always have to do some type of like rotel cheese dip. Oh that sounds cool. Oh, like and some that. spinach yeah, artichoke dip. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. I love the rotel and the Velveeta. Oh yeah. 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 I love any kind of uh, like a cheese dip or cheese ball of any sort yeah. or a cream cheese board that I didn't get to have. All this, talk about the, all this talk about the food, I forget who's playing. Oh, wait a minute. It's the Chiefs. That's there the you go. So, Jeremy, are you partaking in anything on Sunday? Um, I have not planned yet. I usually, I'll be honest with you, I usually go the Sunday of and I head to Price Cutter and I just grab stuff. You know, I, I never yeah. plan it really, but I just grab it. Mm -hmm. You know, I like that. the beauty of that, too, is they got it all ready for you. Mm -hmm. Just open it up and eat. You yeah, know? see that? I'm kind of lazy like that, especially on a Sunday. Yeah. yeah. I don't blame you. So we're also talking about crazy things that you have found under your couch cushion. And it could be the same as the food you're going to eat uh, mm -hmm. on Sunday, you know. Um, okay, yeah. can, do you want me to go first? Because I'll just tell you what. Yes. It's, it's so embarrassing, though. Yes. So I'm embarrassed, too, for me. Usually yeah, it's it's co you know like people sit on your couch and the coins fall out of their pockets and so it's yeah. coins sometimes, but I my go to snack is a handful of like mixed nuts peanuts and stuff. Well, I never realized how many peanuts I actually drop while I'm eating them because I went I lost a remote so I had to move the couch cushions. It looked like I could have filled three cans of peanuts with all the peanuts oh. inside my couch. It was embarrassing. Yeah. Tasty morsel. Yeah. But aren't you like? Because when I find anything under, I'm like, I'm a really good housekeeper. Oh, I thought I was. How can this be my couch? Yeah. It was filthy. Yeah. What about you, Lee? So I discovered that my granddaughter likes to stick her hand between my couch cushions 
and wipe the Cheetos off of her fingers and leave the oh, Cheeto each oh, time she does it. Gross. <laughs> well, she used to just stick them in the dog's mouth and let the dog lick Oh, it. <laughs> no. So she's moved and on to the couch in, cushions. <laughs> nice. And she went into that bag again for more Cheetos after the dog lick. I'm sure she did. Oh, it's always wow. her bag of Cheetos. <laughs> uh, yeah, she'd be eating and you'd look over and she'd just have her hand in the... Uh, <laughs> yeah, she fingers. Hey, at three years no. old, they don't care. They don't care at three, yeah. yeah. What about you guys? We've had some interesting responses, just real quick. Yes. On the salmon patty, somebody... The salmon patty with ketchup. Yeah, okay. Seems like you'd smell that after a day or two, Ooh. but that, uh, and, and uh, a, a lizard skeleton. Yes, uh, what? Yeah. a mouse that was alive. Right. Poor it was probably was alive when it went in there. Yeah. I would pack up and move if I found a mouse that was alive. This is a public service uh, message to clean out under your couch cushions, everybody. Yes. Yeah. Oh my gosh, wait, did I, I tell you what happened to my uh, the other day at my house? Sorry, you just brought that up, Chris. I was walking into my bedroom, and one of my cats has a little cat um, a little mouse that they play with. So I thought it was their toy. I went to kick it. It was a live mouse in my house. <laughs> yeah, the I cat had brought it. in from outside. Inside your oh. house? Yeah. yeah, it was sitting there. I'm, and I'm never like, coming over again. <laughs> yeah, I'd be moving. <laughs> it was terrifying. I was like, it brought in. They used to bring them in from outside to show me what they brought, and I just had no idea that it was actually real. Uh, guys, we're out of time. I'm so sorry. We love you guys so much. Go okay. Chiefs. And we'll see you next Friday. Bye. All right, don't go anywhere. We'll be back right after this. Can I eat more now? Is that okay? Absolutely. Okay, I'm digging in. <laughs>